happy things. Um, Jeremy has asked me to create a video showing you guys how to use the general or the Dollar Admiral app um, that he has created. Uh, most people start off using their Dollar General app, which is located in your Play Store or your App Store, and that's fine. Um, but Jeremy has made it a whole lot easier for us with visuals included and um, just less steps to take. It's just a one-stop shop. There is a free version and then there's a paid version for $7.99. The free version is the one I'm going to show you guys because I think that's probably what most of you are going to um, lean towards until you realize that it's a, it's a good app and that you, you want to have it. And then I would absolutely suggest getting the paid version just to get rid of the ads that are going to pop up because nobody wants ads while they're shopping. So, um, I already thought I made this portion of the video, but then my camera shut off. So, Jake, what do you want to add to this? We're just going to show you how to use it. That's what we're going to do from start to finish. I like that he has big pictures with the UPCs all right there. I don't have to flip through screenshots or go to a different video and find what, what whatever looks like because I'm very visual. So I'm going to look at something. I'm going to try and first thing I'm going to do is look at something, a picture of something. Then I'm going to try and find that and then I'll worry about the scanning. I don't do what Tanya does and just scan, scan, scan. Yeah, I'll primarily, scan everything. Primarily because I don't like to draw attention to myself and scanning everything in the store. Jake feels like a criminal when we're out penny shopping. I absolutely do not because it's not, there's nothing wrong with penny shopping. He gets really there nervous isn't. about it. There isn't anything wrong with penny shopping, but I still don't like drawing attention to myself or feel like somebody's watching me. So I want to look at the picture. I want to have a good idea of what I'm looking for. And with the Dollar Admiral app, it's real easy to find a nice, clear, big picture of that. And it's even got UPC. So if I can even somewhat memorize the UPC, I can even cut out scanning a all little together. bit longer. Yeah. <clears throat> well, not all together because I want to be sure. Right. I, don't, I absolutely would be mortified if I got up to the register and, and it wasn't a penny. Something wasn't a penny. <laughs> like, well, I've got $7 in my account, and I just rang up a $15 item. Right. So. Um, so, we have sucked our dollar store dry. There are no pennies to be found in our dollar store. So, we've set up a little mock dollar store here at the house. Um, on my chair here. Let me show you guys. Um, how do I flip this around? Oh, I can't. Well... Here, let's do it. No, I can't. It won't let me. So, right here, right here is going to be the regular Dollar General stores, and then you'll also see and hear people talk about the NCI home stores, and that's what this is. An NCI, NCI home store means non-consumable items, and that's going to be a store that has more of your home decor and your stuff that's just a little bit higher quality, um, less food, less clothes more home decor stuff so i'll start um we'll go into our play store and we'll start from there i'll show you what it looks like and you'll hear me talking as i walk through the steps on the screen and we'll go around and scan some things at my dollar general store okay so right now you're seeing uh my phone this is what it looks like you are going to go to your play store or your app store I'll just get completely out of this so I can show you. This is what it's going to look like. This is the Google Play Store. And the very first thing that you need to do is get the Dollar General app. The reason you need to do this is because your information that um, you are going to put into the Dollar Admiral app is going to be the same information that you use with the Dollar General app. So your username and your password for this app right here, the one that we're looking at, the Dollar General app, is going to be the same that you use for your Dollar Admiral app, okay? So we're going to open that up. <clears throat> As most of you know, this is what it looks like. You're going to type in your email um, or your phone number, and then you're going to create a password, and either you sign in or you create an account. Um, when you get in there, you're going to find all the coupons, um, whether they're digital coupons through Dollar General or manufacturer coupons to use during that time frame um, at Dollar General. Okay, so we've got that done. Now let's go back to our Play Store. 
up in the search at the top, you're going to type in Dollar Admiral right here. Now you'll see at the top, the first one is the free, the free version. It says Dollar Admiral Penny Shopping Free or App Free. Okay, the one underneath that is the $7.99 version. And I'm going to suggest that one because you're not going to have any ads pop up um, in the $7.99 uh, paid version. There's also underneath, you'll see that Jeremy Roberts has also created a Dollar General Penny List. Um, he just really takes the work out of all of this for us. I also have that one installed. Let me show you what that looks like. Um, and then you'll see here, he's got the Dollar General Penny Item List um, for 12-10-2019. Of course, every week these update with new items and he provides the graphics. He also provides the UPC or the barcode numbers. He just makes it really, really nice to use. And you guys can get these. The reason I haven't like promoted Jeremy's app in any of my past videos is because it's not my app. You know, like I don't wanna step on anybody's toes. I don't want him to be like, hey, you're getting clout on your YouTube videos from my app. I'm not that way. But he asked me to do this video so very much come to this app to get your your penniless items and i mean you can find it all over facebook really but his his are just the best they've got the best clearest graphics got the upc barcode numbers listed so there's that all right so we're going to go to this free edition at the very top we're going to open this now your screen's going to look a little bit different when you first get this it's going to kind of look like this you're gonna put in your email address that you use for your Dollar General app. You're gonna use the same password that you use for your Dollar General app. And you're gonna to have to verify your account. And then it sends you a code or something along those lines. You verify your account and then you're good to go, okay? He's also got this really cool feature right here at the bottom, you see where it says watch tutorial. That will take you to a YouTube video that is so helpful and so informative. I absolutely, recommend watching that YouTube video just for your own benefit so you're not completely blindly walking through your store trying to figure out how to use this app because it really is so simple and that's the reason he made it is to make this simple and to make it fun and the more information that you have uh, the easier this is all gonna be so watch that that video tutorial for sure okay so this is what the app looks like inside you'll notice at the bottom You'll see a blue button and a red button. One of them says home, one of them says regular because there are two different types of Dollar Generals. If you don't know if you are in an NCI home store or a regular store, um, you typically can tell because there, it looks a little, from the outside it absolutely looks the same, but on the inside you'll see that there's more home goods, there's less, there's less regular stuff. Um, hence the hence the difference between the two categories home versus regular and there's also a link that you can click um, in this group somewhere if you guys have questions about where that's at ask one of us we'll provide you the link you can type in your zip code and see if there's an NCI home store near you oh yeah I guess I'll add the description in my YouTube um, in the description here also so if you're not sure if you have an NCI home store, there just aren't very many in some areas. I think we only have three in our state, right? In our whole state, we only have three. But then in some states, you know, there's three within a, an hour radius. So it just kind of depends. So here's how we're gonna go. On the very top, you see Upgrade to Pro. That's gonna ask you to pay the $7.99 um, for the paid version without the ads. The second one is join your Facebook group, but chances are, if you are watching this video, you're probably already in Jeremy's Facebook group. Um, but if not, absolutely click that button and join that group. Cause it's, I mean, it's just really helpful. Lots of visuals, lots of people talking, lots of surprise pennies, lots of current up-to-date posts daily. Um, your second button is your account. That's gonna provide you with all of the, the personal details. Um, the next one is the current penny list like I just showed you. It shows you all the current penny list items, just like this. Really nice, it's just really nice, okay? The next one is coupons. These are the exact same coupons. Here's gonna be an ad that you're gonna, you're gonna see. This is the stuff that you're gonna get on the free version. Sure, if you don't wanna pay the $7.99, is it worth sitting through the ads? Absolutely, but I will pay the $7.99 um, to not sit through the ads. Okay, 
So it's going to pull up all the Dollar General coupons. And that doesn't really apply to penny shopping per se, but a lot of us here, or me for instance, um, I don't just penny shop, I also like to do couponing, a little bit on the extreme couponing side. Um, so having these coupons right here within this app is really, really handy for me. Okay, we're gonna go back. So we're gonna click on regular because my store is regular, most stores are regular. And like I said earlier, another ad, see? See where I'm going with this? It's worth the $7.99 just to get rid of these ads, just so you can go about your business and uh, continue your, sh your shopping. Okay, so this is the chair in my living room. This is our regular dollar store store. The one up here is the home store, okay? I know that that's really terrible, but this is for barcode reading. So when you walk into your store, you are going to be looking at the list that Jeremy provided all of us. You're going to go off the pictures. You're going to kind of remember what they were like, oh, yes, I remember that those picture frames, somebody posted them and they got them for a penny. Okay, so you're going to pick up those items. You're going to scan your barcode. And the lighting in Dollar General is sometimes wonky, so you kind of have to work with it. Maybe my lighting is kind of wonky. Here, Jake's gonna help me. Here we go. Just like this. So, in the dollar, in our dollar store. Now it's gonna pop up green with a smiley face and say, you found a penny, just like that. Here's my favorite part about this entire app. If you were using the regular Dollar General app, you have to keep pushing your barcode and going back and pushing your barcode and going back in order to scan things. You don't have to do that with this app at all. You don't have to push anything else after that. Whoops, and I didn't mean to do that. There we found another penny, just like that. So, another ad. <laughs> helped us okay so you're gonna walk through your store you're gonna scan all of your items you're gonna find all of your pennies okay that's the that's the regular store just like that I don't remember what I was saying before the ad came up so now we're gonna click on home and these another ad oh that's what I was saying it's very much worth spending the eight dollars to get rid of these ads because you don't want to mess with any of this while you're penny shopping or shopping at all so we're in our home store right now. These items are a little bit different than the items in our regular stores. And the concept is exactly the same. I think this one was on the bottom. You just scan them. If you're having, just like that. If you're having problems scanning an item in your store, it's, I'm telling you it's because the lighting is terrible. Another ad. So fun. Got to wait for the bar to run out. We'll X out of it. Okay. Now let's scan our next home item. Just like that. And then it tells you that you have found a penny. All right. Um, I think those were 50 cents. So Jake had a good idea. We're going to scan some things that aren't pennies. Right after this ad. Right after this ad. This video brought to you by Coin Master. Oh, <laughs> Garden Skates. Okay. This just this is why I wanted to do this video with the ads in Oh, these were a penny. Okay, let's go over to these blankets over here. I have these laid out because uh, there's a really awesome deal on blankets happening right now. Yeah, the video. Yeah, I got I got a video. I'll put a card. So these show as three dollars. You see that? These are the the Comfort Bay five dollar fleece throws. Fun fact: that three dollars is. I think with the 40% off because they're, yes. fi they're five. That's exactly how it works. We got all of these blankets today. We got 10 blankets for $11. Will you shine your light on my barcode? So even though that's not penny shopping, it's still um, shopping. Um, what do you, what's the word? Like Thrifty? Couponing. Yeah, like couponing. Excuse me. There we go. Stupid lighting. Okay. So just so you know, you can use this app for regular items as well. And then of course, you're gonna go into, for these blankets example, uh, for example, you would go into your coupons here, you would find the, the corresponding coupon, 
and attach it. You can clip your coupons from this app and apply them at the register just like you would with the Dollar General app. There is another ad. My point is proven with the ads. Just upgrade the $7.99 um, paid version. Yeah, I mean, we spend more than that in coffee in one day. Well, one coffee, six bucks, so right. we get rid of ads. All right, so we're going to stop this video, and I'll bring you back to my face here. Okay, right, so what else should we add to this? It is really simple. I know that this isn't a dollar store setup, but I need you to use your imagination because I don't have any pennies left in my store because I go get them all. I literally get all of them. We our don't. store does a real good job. At yeah, them. our store does a very good job. If we were out of town, that would be a different story. I could go in and find pennies for you guys. Um, but I've got all the pennies at our local Did store. Did you the Barbie? No, but it's a penny. Right, but it's important to note that it was in the clearance aisle. Right, and, and when you're penny shopping, you guys, you're going to find pennies all over the place. You're going to find them in the clearance aisle. You're going to find them where they're supposed to be. You're going to find them back behind things, above High, things, under low. things. Um, you just have to be patient. When I first went penny shopping, I took my daughter with me. I couldn't even wait till Jake got off work because I like was so excited. Like, oh my goodness, there's a thing. We can get all these things for pennies. I was so excited. And my daughter and I went, and I don't know, we probably looked for 25 minutes or so. And I about gave up, like, we're not going to find any. And then my daughter found one. And when that green button lit up on the Dollar Admiral app and with a smiley face that it was a penny, like, we couldn't stop from that point on. And we just keep finding pennies, 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 pennies. It's just lots of fun. So I hope you guys um, enjoyed this video. I hope that you enjoy Jeremy's app. It's really helpful. It's my favorite to use. Um, it's just a lot easier. Everything is there for you. There's no flipping back and forth. It's just a really great app to have. So I strongly suggest that. I will link some other videos about penny shopping up here in the screen somewhere. You'll see them pop up. Just click on them and it'll take you to those a little bit more detailed, um, how to penny shop um, type of videos or how to coupon type of videos. If you want to get those blankets for a dollar, um, I'll put that video in there as well. And I think that's it. Yeah. That's it. That's it. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.